Hi brothers and sisters in Christ. I have a prophetic word here again from the Lord. This word is not for everyone. So you will know if this word is for you, if it resonates in your spirit, and also if you ask the Lord for confirmation and he makes it clear for you. Believe in no man or woman, but always trust in the one true God and always examine everything you hear with the scriptures and ask the Lord for confirmation. I will type out this word and I will put it on the blog page and I'll put the link down in the description for you below this video. Alternatively, you can go to this YouTube channel, go to the about section, scroll down to the links and click blog to access it. Now, before I read this word, I'm just going to pray over it. My beautiful God, Lord, I love you and I adore you. Thank you, my King, that you are the one who gives us words of encouragement, comfort and affirmation. Thank you that you know who we are. Thank you that you created us in your image, my Lord, and that you, my God, have good purposes and works for us to do on this earth. Father, I come in the name of Jesus, and I just plead the blood of Jesus over this video and this word, and I ask, my Lord, that you will make a way for it, so that it will reach the people who need to hear this word. I pray, my Lord, that they will be edified, that they will be strengthened, and that you will give them the necessary confirmations that they need. Father, I bind and I break by the power of your blood and my power of your name, my Lord Jesus, every attempt from Satan over this word, and I just command it all into utter darkness, in Jesus' most holy name. Amen. Okay, so the Lord said, Listen for my voice in the dark. You will hear it clearly. Don't be distressed in your innermost being about all that is taking place around you and all that is coming. These things must occur according to my word. Don't mourn the yesterdays any longer. You need to move quickly, swiftly, speedily. There is no time to gather anymore. It is just go, go, go from here on out. Know and understand the season and time you are currently in. Don't get left behind, but stay in tune with my spirit. You do not see what is coming. Neither will I show you the entire picture. I require trust diligence and obedience this hour. You will do well in keeping that in mind. Life is not about all that you can see, all that you can have and all that you desire. Life is about spending time in my presence, seeking my face, doing the works I ask of you. You are my creation, created for a purpose. The more, the more you pursue earthly things and the more you fix your heart and mind on them, the more you will struggle and stumble and fall. For those things are deceptive fallacies created to entice and draw your heart and purpose away from me, to become more mindful of self rather than becoming more mindful of God. I created you in my image for a reason. Conduct your affairs in alignment and in agreement with my truths. Stop worrying about tomorrow. Tomorrow will take care of itself. Lift up your eyes to me this day, child, because that is where your help comes from. My beautiful God, Lord, help us to keep our eyes on you. Help us to know the times and seasons that we are in. Give us greater wisdom, discernment, knowledge and insight to know the ways that we are to take. Help us, my Lord, to stay in tune with you. And help us, my God, to keep our lamps burning and to keep our hearts pure before you. Keep filling us more with your truth, Lord, and with your life. Refresh us this day, my King, and help us to go and conquer new territories for you. In Jesus' most holy name. Amen. All right, my brothers and sisters, have a wonderful day. God bless you.